Old Paul and Jess police tell me this is the mark of the suspected shooter. They say he parked here, got out, started shooting inside this home before getting stuck here, taking off and leaving victims behind. Gunfire rang out just after 8 o'clock last night along East Avenue in Paul's Valley. It sounded like a ball peen hammer of some kind popping, you know, like they were hitting steel. Two people were hit. In fact, we got so many calls that we checked back on the call recorder and it couldn't even keep up. This was the man police say all those people were calling about. Christopher Dylan Mars. Police walked us through what he's accused of doing. Uh, you could see the perfect trail. It starts behind the vehicle here, firing into the house uh, and then proceeds around. We started finding shell casings right here at the edge of the concrete. No motive, but a tie to the neighborhood. We're told the man's ex lived up the street. Her grandmother says the whole situation is scary. Yeah, I'm glad he's going to get his punishment. And in an unusual move, that suspect walked right up to the jail and turned himself in. Macarain, KOCO 5 News.